hi everyone now let's see the html form elements so one of the form element is a drop down list so how we can represent the drop down list uh, on the page let us see hash doc type html sorry it's not hash html body h2 so here i'm just writing the select uh, elements in the drop down list so whatever the elements you want you just select that element a single element in drop down list okay so close the h2 tag now uh, write the form tag so here i'm using the submit button so if you are using the submit button try to write the form tag so here the uh, i'm writing the action so whenever i fill the details and whenever i click on the submit actually here you need to write the server uh, page that is a dot php page or dot c or dot java page but here i'm just uh, using this uh, client side scripting it's a static pages so uh, here i'm using just form action is equal to any of the page any of the image i'm just calling so let's take the audi dot jpg so this pick uh, pick dot jpg pick is already downloaded and saved in the html folder so that's why i'm just calling that form action is equal to whenever i click on that submit it has to perform action uh, means it navigate to that image page image will be appeared on that page so uh, here i need to explain the drop down list for drop down list you need to write a uh, select tag select name is equal to oh, i'm taking cars so the option select contains the option attributes the elements option value is equal to let's take audi close the option tag again open another option value is equal to uh, this time i'm taking olvo So just remember whatever the letters you are writing. Olvo. Close the option tag. Take another option. Value is equal to. Uh, let's take me BMW. Option. And uh, let me take option value is equal to let's take I twenty. Close option tag. And finally close the select tag and body tag as well as HTML tag. Now save the program. So this is drop down list drop down list dot html save run the program launch in internet explorer so here just a uh, select element in the drop down list sorry i didn't write the submit button just write the submit button also because I'm using the form tag so after select you need to write the submit and you need to close the form tag also I forgot to close the form tag input type is equal to submit ok and close the form tag
form f o r m okay so if you want to you just give the tag here and options you just have to select just give the break tag and here you just give the value so that whatever the value that uh, the value that appear on the submit button let's take submit or write me whatever the message you want to display on the submit button write value using that name refresh okay so whenever you click this so these are the options i have entered audi old bmw i20 submit so whenever i click on that submit it will navigate to uh, audi.jpg means the page that, uh, displays the audi.jpg picture okay so whatever the want, want you just give that so let me write bmw so this is also i saved picture downloaded from google and saved in the dot html page run it launch in internet explorer so whatever the field has selected it will display only whenever you whenever i uh, suppose if i take the audi only when i click on that it will display the bmw picture because i had taken form action is equal to bmw dot jpg so just displays the bmw dot jpg picture okay so whatever you had taken because i didn't when any sessions okay like this you want to display i20 this also i downloaded save refresh it i20 right this is i20 card okay so this is form element drop down list using of drop down list so let me show you uh, another element so that i'll explain the next video